Hello and welcome to another tier list. This time we're doing the Undertale character tier list. So, just to want to remind everybody that I do tier lists every Wednesday. So if you're interested, feel free to check out some of my other videos. I got a whole playlist dedicated to tier lists now. Undertale. Uh, it's been a long time since I played this game. Uh, I found another tier list that had a bunch of more characters on it. I'm going to stick with the main ones, uh, and this tier list seems to be pretty good. Um, I don't remember the name of that ghost blob thing. What was his name? Shoot, I actually have to look that up real quick. Oh yeah, Napstablook. Right, 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 right. Okay, cool. Alright, so, I'm going to go through this list, and we're just going to rank everybody. So, uh, let's get started with Asgore. Asgore, I, I would put up in A tier. Uh, his boss battle was so much fun the soundtrack was really fun and i just think he's a really cool character i think asgore was uh fun a, a lot of fun very enjoyable uh napsta look i'm gonna put up in c tier fun character but there just uh wasn't much to him uh i thought he was like fairly enjoyable but again like I love so many of these other characters, I feel like I need to give space above Napster Blick with how much I appreciate him. Uh, Temi has to go to Colleg. <laughs> I'll throw Temi up in B tier, why not? She's a, she's a really funny character. Um, not, not, a, not much else to say about Temi. Uh, I just really like her, but I'm not like super fond of her. It's like, you know, just like... Just like mild enjoyment, enjoy, enjoyment. <laughs> okay, Papyrus is going up in S tier, baby. Papyrus is one of my favorite characters in Undertale. He is so much fun. Uh, he's hilarious. The writing, even the sound effect, kind of makes me laugh. Of like whenever he speaks, I really enjoy Papyrus. Uh, love that guy. It's great. So much fun. Uh, Chara, you know what? Screw it. Uh, so I haven't played Genocide Run, so I'm just gonna throw Chara and I'm gonna throw Gaster up in D tier. Uh, I get like the mysterious element and everything, but I haven't gotten a chance to know them yet. But I'm just gonna throw them in D tier because they don't matter to me right now. Uh, the main character, what's their name? Uh, Frisk. Frisk, right, right, right. Frisk I'm also gonna throw up in C tier. Like, it's kind of cool character, doesn't really say much, doesn't really say anything, but uh, in this spooky world making friends with all these monsters, uh, I... Not, not else much to say about Frisk. Sans! <laughs> I'm gonna throw him up in A tier. I think he's a really fun character. But I enjoy Papyrus more. I think I just get more enjoyment with Papyrus. But Sans is definitely like a very fun character. And uh, I've had a lot of great moments with him. I haven't done the genocide run, so I haven't actually done like the Sans battle or anything like that yet. But I will say that uh, I just I, I like Sans a lot. <laughs> That's all I have to say about him, really. Uh, but yeah, uh, the humor dynamic between Sans and Papyrus together, love them, it's great. Uh, Toriel, also gonna throw up an A tier. I think, uh, yeah, Goat Mom is definitely really fun. Uh, she's incredibly sweet, and she makes, what, like, butterscotch pie or something? I, I it, man, it's been so long since I've played Undertale, but... Uh, I definitely like love her motherly presence, but also like her enforcement and shit. Um, I will say that I accidentally killed her in my first playthrough because I didn't know how <laughs> I didn't know how to like get past her. Otherwise, I felt like I was forced to kill her, and I felt so bad. I felt so bad. Uh. Okay, Metaton. Metaton is also S tier. Metaton is just so much fun. He is a blast. I 
wish that I could hire Metaton to be like my birthday party entertainer because he would do such a great job. Uh, the, the whole thing with like the game show and everything like like I, I pff, Metaton is like as of now like the best character out of all that I've listed. He is absolutely fantastic. I love uh, that form that he takes in uh, the second part of the boss fight. Metatona X or something, I think. Uh, yeah, really cool. Uh, Asriel. Uh, I'm gonna throw Asriel up in seats here. Again, like, I, I feel more attachment to the characters that have gotten more screen time, so maybe I'm just biased in that regard. I mean, Asriel was fun, but, uh, I mean, it was just one battle. It didn't really feel all that much. I don't know. There's that, I guess. Uh, Flowey. I'll throw Fl Flowey up in B tier. I think he's a very interesting and fun villain, and there's a lot of great dynamics to him. But at the end of the day, you know, it's just Flowey. You're just being Flowey and being ruthless and mean and horrible, and there's only so much appreciation that you can have for someone like that. Uh, Alphys? I'll throw her up in B tier as well. I think Alphys is uh, pretty fun. Uh, I like her character. I like her quirks, her nerdiness, her uh, obsession with anime. I think uh, <laughs> I, I, I think she's a fun character. And uh, when I saw like the whole uh, shipping scene between uh, Alphys and Undyne. I, I, I grew like a lot more appreciation for Alphys after that, so yeah, uh, definitely appreciate her. But Undyne, I think, is my favorite Undertale character. I <laughs> had so much fun with her battles, her interactions with Papyrus and the cooking, the shipping between her and Alphys, but she is like also supposed to be like this dominant, strong knight that is fearless, that will protect the monster world from humans. I love it. I love Undyne so much. She's great. She's fantastic. Fish Lady is so much fun. Love her. Love her. Love her. Okay. Uh, I gotta, I gotta evaluate who, who do I put within the tier spots. Uh, I'm just doing a little bit of reorganizing right now. But, uh, yeah, yeah, I think I'm pretty biased towards, uh, screen time, and I'm just thinking, like, which characters do I enjoy more? Uh, I guess that's about right. I, I feel like this is an appropriate Undertale character tier list, and, like, where I evaluate everybody, pretty much. Uh, I'm almost tempted to put Temi into C tier, but I won't. Because she's friggin' adorable, and I just love that face. <laughs> But yeah, uh, Undyne, Metaton, and Papyrus are my favorite characters in Undertale, and everybody else, they're enjoyable, they're good, like them, but I just, I just have like a special appreciation for uh, the ones at the top, and you know, they're my favorites, and I love them. Uh, again, I still haven't done the genocide ending, but uh, I might get to it sometime, we'll see. <laughs> We'll see if I get the courage to actually uh, uh, fight Sans and everybody else in due time. We'll, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, hope you like this video. Uh, if you're interested, uh, please go ahead, like the video, and uh, subscribe. I do tier lists every Wednesday. And uh, if you want to suggest other tier lists, drop a comment down below. Let me know uh, what kind of tier list you're interested in. Uh, and if you're interested in watching some of my old stream footage from years ago, I've got playlists on uh, like edited uh, videos of old streams where I played uh, both the neutral ending and the pacifist ending for Undertale. So we got that. Although those were like years back, so I'm pretty sure that like my quality was not... <laughs> as good, like microphone quality and everything probably wasn't up to where I have it today. But yeah, that's, uh, that's all I got to say. I hope to see you guys next week for the next tier list. 
and I also release other videos on Friday. So yeah, there's that. All right, take care. Peace out. Hope you have a good one. Bye. -bye.